Well, Corey is checking out Cirque du Soleil, OVO, at Talk and Stick Resort Arena in downtown Phoenix. Yeah, you don't have to go to Vegas to check out this show, Corey. How about that? No, you do not. And boy, when, when Cirque du Soleil rolls into town, they bring along cases and cases and cases of costumes, hundreds of them, for the dozens of performers that make up this beautiful show. It's called OVO, which means egg in Portuguese. And we're headed into the holy of holies here when it comes to costumes. And lucky for us, we've got Christine Aschenpong with us. Hello. Thank you so much for, Thank you for sharing coming. your friends with us. Sure. <laughs> this is Alana. She's a spider, obviously. A spider, yes. This is Jan. He is known as the foreigner. The foreigner. Yeah, exactly. um, well, oh, yeah, there he is. <laughs> so, if you can, while we watch them kind of stretch out and yeah. warm up, give me, a, can you uh, sort of synopsize Ovo? Of What's course. the show about? What happens? Of course. So, Ovo means egg in Portuguese. Mm -hmm. So, the show starts with a giant egg on stage, a giant mysterious egg on stage. And then we have the mysterious foreigner who comes and mm -hmm. happens upon an so insect. So, does colony. he pop out of the egg? He doesn't I, I... pop out of the egg, but he comes on stage or he comes into the crowd with an egg on his back. Oh, I see. So, it's so very mysterious. You're the you're, you're an egg, uh, an egg humper, so to speak. You got one on your back. Um, what, is this your only costume? Where we see you in other forms during the show? Oh yeah, it's, it's he's very mysterious. It's I mysterious. see. Mysterious. He I likes to you. keep it mysterious. Well, so it's a day in the life of an insect colony. So mm -hmm. you'll see a bunch of different insects, yes. including our spider here. Now, Alana, you seem very limber. <laughs> I cannot do what you're doing. I, if Jan sat on this bad. thigh and you sat on this knee, I could it. probably do it. Um, <laughs> so you grew up in uh, Great Britain. Yes. Did you imagine as a child that this would be your world? Well, when yeah, I keep was, pushing, Jan. When I was eight years old, I saw my first Cirque du Soleil show. And that's when I oh, said yes. to my parents, that's what I want to do when I'm older. Yeah. So for me, I'm living my dream. Mission accomplished. <laughs> yeah. um, well, have you been to Phoenix before? No, it's the first time. Has Jan ever done this to your back? No, he hasn't. I think he should. Yes, he should. <laughs> it's fantastic. Well, I wish the weather could be better. I'm sorry we're only at nice. 70. Coming from the UK, it's beautiful weather. Uh, it's great. <laughs> well, I cannot wait to see you two in action. And uh, how many, by the way, do you know how many castmates you have in uh, the show? There's 50 of us, 50 artists. Wow. And then 50 other members, like tour management, physio, wardrobes. Mm -hmm. There's 100 of us all touring together. Gotcha. Hey, lift me up under the arms there. Oh. No, come on. Don't fool with me now. I need help. You can do Ah, uh, there we go. Yeah, see, this is how I like to roll. <laughs> Jan, you're a very helpful guy now. As the foreigner, by the way, uh, is he a hero? Is he a villain? He's what? a little bit of a clown, as you can see. He's a he little, a he's a little funny, mm -hmm. a little, uh, little full of himself, as you can see. Obviously. Um, but he's great. He is actually one of the characters that are involved in the love story during the show. So oh, I see. I don't want to spoil it for you guys. Oh, it's a lot of weird, not a lot of weird breeding or anything, is not, there? Not weird breeding, but very interesting love story. Oh, gotcha. Well, let's talk about your costumes. There, I, I don't know how many pieces there we must be. We travel with over a thousand pieces of costume. Really? So everything from sewing machines, washing machines, we travel with it all. So every week we're packing in and packing out. Um, as you can see, these are um, the foreigner <laughs> shoes, the longest shoes. In, uh, yes, hold those up so we can away. see them. Wow. They Jan, what are you, you, like a 74... <laughs> Double A? you got a pretty narrow foot there, friend. I'd say it's like a size 40, 45. Uh, well, who knows? This oh is gosh. another pair of shoes. So this is um, Master Filippo, who is our beetle, one of our beetles in the show. Mm -hmm. um, very intricate. So we make all the costumes in Montreal. They get shipped to tour, and they get fit to the artists again. So yeah. uh, things like this, like under our fan, you can see we dye, we dye our own shoes. Um, we oh, you get a shoe dyeing operation? We, we That's every them. woman's dream, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's a lot of work, though. It's a lot of work. This is Great. Well, thank you so much. And uh, Alana, would you step over by Jan, if you would? Uh, this, man, if that was a prom photograph, I don't know what <laughs> high school this is, but you two look fantastic. Remember, OVO is the show, and uh, they open tomorrow uh, right down here. Talking stick. <laughs> Let me hear that again. <laughs> That's how we speak. This is how we communicate. <laughs> Hey, ja, was soll? Wieso ja? Ah, es tut mir leid, ich spreche kein Deutsch. <laughs> ah. <laughs> anyway, more coming your way from all your friends at OVO. We'll see you again in just a couple of minutes. God, they look amazing. How neat is it to go behind the... I mean, they travel well, see, with their own washing machines. They're dying the their own die. shoes. Can that, you imagine? It takes so much to put that show together. Back to AZAM. Corey is checking out Cirque du Soleil, OVO, at Talking Stick Resort Arena. And we were just saying, Cor, it is so cool when you get behind the scenes. Yeah, that was really interesting. It was. I know. Yeah. yeah. I know. 
the access is so fun, and that's what we love about Cirque du Soleil. They're always willing to uh, uh, show you a little, give you a little peek behind the curtain, so to speak. And we've got so many of our friends out this morning. This is Dima. Dima is a cricket. This is Jan. Jan is an unknown creature of foreign extraction. This is Rene, home country, unknown, also a cricket of the female like variety. Rene. This is Alana. She's a spider with we a horn. Her, yeah. We don't know why. And uh, this is Nate, also a cricket. And uh, I'll be getting some cricket training. Now, uh, one more time. Uh, I don't know. Now, Jan, tell me a little bit about your friend Rene. Uh, well, uh, yeah. What? Um, <coughs> yeah, I don't know why she's not in costume. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, yeah, but that, uh, um, uh, six, 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 no. six, 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 six. Oh, Alana, have you been next to Renee for long? You've been working together a long time? Um, yeah, a little bit. Two that minutes. Our Renee. Yeah. yeah, she's fitting in well. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that looks a lot oh. like our Renee. It does look a lot like your Renee, yes, Troy. It does. You've met Troy, uh, you're right. <laughs> Hey, Cricket. Yeah, you've like, seen his work on the internet, really have you not? No. Yeah. Is she going to get on the trapeze uh, Yes, you know how shy Renee is. Yeah, we'll get her on to something. She's going to be on the trampoline as well. We'll show her at the end of the show. But, Nate, jump up here if you would, friend. Uh, tell me, uh, as a Cricket, Crickets, we know, you've got massive quads as a Cricket. Am I right? For lots of leaping, high-flying action, um, did you grow up as a trampoline performer? Yeah, uh, I started in gymnastics. I mm -hmm. transitioned to trampoline, and yeah, I absolutely love it. Yeah, well, it shows. You guys yeah. are just terrific. Um, how uh, how do you describe OVO, the show, to people? When they say, well, what do you do for a living? What do you tell people? Uh, I'm a full-time insect. I'm a full-time bug. <laughs> but no, That's it's a good a, way to live, eh? Yeah, yeah, no, it's a fun show. It's bright. It's uh, easy to follow story. It's beautiful. It's colorful, and it's a show for everyone. And the acrobatics, too, like... Yeah. Well, it's let's see some of those. I'll step off and uh, make sure that you're not in danger. I'll spot you from over here, if that's all right. Now, here goes Nate. This is, oh my gosh, it's so great. And by the way, Troy and Celeste, we're, we're looking at uh, a professional trampoline. This isn't the kind that you're going to, you know, dig a hole in your backyard and then kind of stretch some fabric over it it's uh it's about as good as it gets and uh these guys uh, hop over here if you would uh, uh nate uh, just one more question for you you open tomorrow have you been to phoenix before no it's my first time oh really and wow. I, lo I love it it's warmer than i home. know isn't it great yeah it's, what's your home uh, town toronto canada oh yes by the way uh cirque du soleil formed in 1984 in toronto we're so glad that you're here and thank you so much for working with our friend renee um she came in here a raw recruit but uh, her tramp work is just fantastic yeah look at this troy <laughs> celeste i can't See, believe look at her go got renee, yeah good she's keeping That's her good. dress down which is important yeah we told her to wear a culotte, but she said, oh, no, I'll be fine. I'll be fine with this mini dress. Hey, that's a good All workout right. still. Hey, you guys, hop up here if you would. These are some of your friends you'll be meeting at OVO. We open tomorrow. It's going to be one of the coolest shows in town. We'll see you down at Talking Stick Resort Arena. Bye, everybody.